that makes me angry, I can't think of like a specific one, but whenever I'm having a disagreement with somebody and you know, you go and look something up later and you're like, I was right, that was the year of Irish independence or whatever, and you don't ever see them again, and I still get angry that I didn't get to prove that I was right, because I'm an <laughs> My funniest onset memory is uh, one time I did a really low budget film in Canada or something, and I took um, what I thought was the Canadian version of like Sudafed. It turned out that it was more like NyQuil. When I took it, I, I didn't feel any better. I felt sleepier and sleepier, so I kept taking more, thinking that it would finally like clear my sinuses and you know I'd be able to focus on work. And so I was basically taking more and more NyQuil. And I finally had to tell somebody like, I think, I think I'm like stoned at work. <laughs> So that was uncomfortable. My funniest memory is this one time I did this interview and they were asking me about all my memories. And the entire interview was about memories and I have a terrible memory and I didn't have the heart to tell them. But we carried on anyway, <laughs> like it wasn't going badly. I don't actually remember having a teen idol crush because everybody that I knew liked Jonathan and Taylor Thomas. And I, I think solely just because I didn't want to like the same thing that everybody else did. I pretended to hate Jonathan Taylor Thomas, but I, but I think secretly I probably did. Total follower. My most embarrassing memory is one that I'm obviously not going to tell you. But it's really embarrassing. You know, you'd really laugh. It would be really good entertainment. <laughs>